What is projectile motion? Projectile motion refers to the motion of an object that is projected into the air and then moves under the influence of gravity. This type of motion is a two-dimensional motion, meaning that it occurs in both the horizontal and vertical directions simultaneously. When an object is projected horizontally, it will continue to move at a constant velocity in the horizontal direction. The gravity will act on it in the vertical direction, causing it to follow a curved path known as a parabola. The object will continue to move along this path until it hits the surface or land back on the ground. How is it applied in your sports? Projectile motion plays an important role in the sport of volleyball. In fact, most of the movements in volleyball are a combination of both horizontal and vertical motions. Here are a few ways in which projectile motion is applied in volleyball. Number 1. Serving When a player serves the ball, they apply a certain amount of force to it in a specific direction, causing it to travel through the air in a projectile motion. The server must aim the ball high enough to clear the net, but not so high that it goes out of bounds. Number 2. Spiking When a player spikes the ball, they jump up and hit the ball with a downward force causing it to travel in a projectile motion towards the other team's side of the court. The player must aim the ball high enough to clear the net but not so high that it can be easily defended by the opposing team. Number 3. Blocking When a player blocks the ball, they jump up and try to intercept the ball before it crosses the net. This requires them to calculate the trajectory of the ball and time their jump correctly in order to successfully block the ball. Number 4. Digging when a player digs the ball, they must calculate the trajectory of the ball and position themselves in a such nice way that they can successfully intercept the ball before it hits the ground. This requires an understanding of the principles of projectile motion and the ability to make quick adjustments based on the trajectory of the ball. In all of these instances, an understanding of the principles of projectile motion is essential in order to successfully execute the different skills required in the sport of volleyball. What is momentum? Momentum is a fundamental concept in physics that describes the motion of an object in terms of its mass and velocity. It is defined as the product of an object's mass and velocity and is represented by the symbol P. Momentum is a vector quantity, which means that it has both magnitude and direction. The direction of momentum is the same as the direction of the object's velocity. How is it applied in your sport? In volleyball, momentum plays an important role in the movement and collisions of the balls and players. Here are some examples of how momentum is applied in volleyball. Spike. When a player spikes the ball, they generate momentum by jumping up and hitting the ball with force. The momentum of the ball and the player's arm will transfer to the other side of the court, making it more difficult for the other team to return the ball. Block. When a player blocks the ball, they use their body to absorb the and redirect the momentum of the ball. By jumping and reaching over the net, the blocker can disrupt the trajectory of the ball and slow down its momentum, making it easier for the team to defend it. Dive When a player dives to save the ball, they use their momentum to slide and reach the ball. The player's momentum helps them recover more ground and reach the ball before it hits the ground. 4. Serve when a player serves the ball, they generate momentum by striking the ball with force. The momentum of the ball will cause it to travel faster and with more force, making it more difficult for the opposing team to return the ball. Overall, momentum plays a crucial role in the movement and collisions of the ball, and players in volleyball, understanding and utilizing the principles of momentum can help players improve their technique and performances on the court. Next, what is impulse? In physics, Impulse is a concept that describes the change in momentum of an object that occurs when a force is applied to it over a period of time. Impulse is defined as the product of force and the time interval over which the force is applied. One important application impulse is in collision. When two objects collide, the impulse exerted by each object is equal to opposite according to the law of conservation of momentum. By analyzing the impulse and momentum of each object before and after collision, C6 it can determine how the collision occurred and how much energy was transferred between the objects. Next, 
how it is ampli- applied in your sport. In volleyball, impulse is an important concept that applies to various skills and movements. Here are some examples of how impulse is applied in volleyball. Number 1. Serving When a player serves the ball, they apply a force to the ball over a certain period of time. The impulse transfer to the ball affects its velocity and trajectory, make it more difficult for the opposing team to return the serve. Number 2. Blocking When a player blocks the ball, they apply a force to the ball in order to deflect it. The impulse transfer to the ball affects its trajectory and the amount of force it will apply to the player on the opposing team. Number 3. Spiking When a player spikes the ball, they apply a force to the ball over a certain period of time, generating an impulse that affects the velocity and trajectory of the ball. The impulse transfer to the ball can make it more difficult for the opposing team to return the spike. Number 4. Digging When a player digs the ball, they apply a force to the ball over a certain period of time, generating an impulse that affects the velocity and trajectory of the ball. The impulse transfer to the ball can help the player control the direction of the ball and set up a successful play. Overall, impulse is an important concept in volleyball that applies to many skills and movements. By understanding and utilizing the principles of impulse, Players can improve their technique and performance on the court.